Hi there, welcome to Anatomy with Ashley. I'm going to do a quick model review of this circulatory man. So let's get started. Here we have the temporal artery and vein. So all of the arteries are going to be red and the veins are going to be blue. Okay, so temporal artery and vein, you've got your facial vein and artery. This is your internal jugular. This is your external jugular. This will be your right subclavian vein and right subclavian artery. This would be your right common carotid, your left common carotid. Since you see his face is turned to the left, you will these kind of get tucked behind, so it's not gonna be very symmetrical. So you've got the, this is the internal jugular here, and then also your left subclavian vein and your left, left subclavian artery. And if you follow this down, it's towards the, on the body side, think B is gonna be your basilic, and then this one here is gonna be your cephalic vein, okay? And then um, same thing on this side, B by the body, basilic and cephalic, this is your subclavian artery, comes down to be your brachial artery here. His hand is turned so it's not in actual anatomical position. So pay attention to what thumb side is going to be your radial side and then your ulnar side is the pinky, correct? So if we do that over here, you've got your left subclavian comes down to your brachial artery which you follow the bones, this is your thumb side, that's the radius side, so this will be your radial artery, and then your pinky side, follow that up, that's your rad uh, ulnar artery here, okay? Okay, once we get into this portion here, we know the subclavians um, come into the superior vein, or the um, brachial, brachiocephalic veins here and here, it's right before it splits, okay? So then it comes down into uh, the superior vena cava and then into the right atrium and then, you know, so on as far as the heart circulation goes, okay? This is your pulmonary trunk, gonna go to the pulmonary arteries and the pulmonary veins. Yes, those are backwards. I told you everything red is um, artery and vein. This is the only instance that they will be opposite, okay? So this is your aortic arch. Once it goes down behind, it actually comes through the diaphragm, and this is going to be your abdominal aorta here, this whole thing. This is your inferior vena cava here, this whole chunk of the blue, okay? We'll go specifics with the rest. Um, this here is your celiac trunk. Um, then we have your superior mesenteric, is this one here. Then you have your gonadal, comes down here. Then on this little one here is the inferior mesenteric, okay? Then you have common iliac, left and right. Then one goes in and one stays out. That's your internal iliac and external iliac. So you have an artery and vein of that same name, okay? Internal iliac vein, internal iliac artery, external iliac vein, and external iliac artery, and you have a left and right as well. 